What is up guys? Welcome on back to TK's garage. Obviously, I made it into OKC because look what's here. We got the 1953 Pontiac Chieftain on deck and I gotta give a major, major, major shout out to my dude Randy over Auto Auction Rebuilds. Look at this, man. You see this? He got the battery tender and everything on the car for me. See, look, man, I keep telling y'all this shit. It's very rare to have good friends or good people around you. And when you do have those people around you, you got to keep them people close, man. Anywho, those lights don't sound happy. I'm going to get this all the way up. So we're going to do a couple different things. This thing hasn't been driven in a little bit. So been a couple weeks. Shit, probably a month, right? Been sitting for at least a month. We're going to uh, fire her up, get her running, take her for a little bit of a drive. Maybe go get some coffee or something. And then uh, we're going to talk a little bit about what's going on with the car. For the longest time. First things first, though, she is clean and immaculate. There's no dust or craziness on it since, you know, we cleaned it before it was parked. And, uh, you know, she looks good, man. She's in good shape. With the battery tender on it, the battery should be good. Though I do see that light is not on. Oh, because they have the cable off. Okay, cool. That's a positive. I guess. Huh. Maybe there was something parasitic drawing or something on it. Who knows? But I'll get her together here in a few minutes. And we'll see if she uh, will run appropriately. I hope so. <sighs> but first, I got to get a damn sweater. It's fucking cold. Woo! All right. So we'll pull the battery tender off. Because I'm guessing that the battery died again. All right. Charge and maintain. Yep, I see that. So that's what they had it on. Man, major shout out, major shout out to Randy for this, man. I'm telling y'all, man. The people, the company you keep is so important, man. All right, I need to tighten that up, though. Because I don't want that to be loose. And then we'll fire her up. Let's see how she does after a, a month. She's cold as hell in here. The shifter feels stiffer. I bet Randy did some stuff to the car. <laughs> oh, let's see. Fuel pump. Okay. I don't expect her to be happy after sitting for a month, so, or a few weeks. Damn near a month. All right, let's try it again. Come on, girl. She doesn't want to stay running. Idle, idle, idle. Damn. She's right there and just won't go. Damn, I need her to run, man. Come on, girl. Let's get it. She's right there. She's running and then she dies. Hey, 
And it's probably not helping that it's freezing friggin' cold out, right? It don't help that it's cold out, I'm sure. Come on, girl. Oh boy. <laughs> Come on, girl. I need you to start, baby. She just won't stay running. She just won't stay running. She's right there. I know someone's gonna say, hey, you're grinding the starter. I got it. Oh boy. She's getting closer. She's getting closer to running. Hold on. There she is. Idle, 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 idle. Idle, old girl. Idle, damn it. Woo! She's right there, man. Shout out to Austin for the solid battery and shout out for Randy for keeping this on the tender. Now I know why. Feather the gas, feather the gas. There she is. Idle, 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 idle girl, idle, yeah! Just takes a little work, man. A little work and she'll get running. <laughs> I don't know, man. I might not want to sell this. Because, you know, it's kind of like an accomplishment when you get the damn thing started. <laughs> and then she does. Right. Let's just let her idle. If she'll idle now. Looks like she will. All right, she's running, she runs, kind of, runs good too. It takes a little bit to get her running, man. I mean, you saw it, I probably, <coughs> damn, I probably started her friggin' 20 something times. Part of that is because there's no choke but she runs now once she's running she's good Whew. I'm gonna take my ass out here while this is uh, doing its thing so it is below freezing out here today and I want to take her uh, out and see how she drives in the cold I mean I, last time we had her out it wasn't like it was warm out it was cold but uh yeah she runs man i'm happy that she's running I'll tell you that very happy that it's running but we're gonna take her out and there's a couple things i need to get addressed on it today uh need to get that carburetor which I, i'm gonna be honest with you i'm not doing it it's gonna get done by a shop uh so maybe this would be a two-part video who knows but uh yeah, I'm not doing it. I can tell you that much. Um, it's going to get done by a shop. And that should make it run better, I guess. They're going to check the points and stuff for me too. 
uh, but I know you guys would really want to see me do this Route 66 trip on it, but uh, I have this tuned and as much as I want to run this thing down there, I just, I just can't do it, man. I don't want to, I don't want to push it, you know? I don't want to break it. Now, will she move under her own power? It looks like it. Looks like she's coming out pretty good. All right. We're almost at, I thought that she had 74. She's got 70,000 miles on it. She's about to have 71. We gonna break that milestone on this one for sure. Let me button up that garage real quick. Make sure she's in neutral. She is. All right. I'll pull that just because. Oh. Let's go have an enjoyable cup of coffee, I think. Oh. Right in reverse. That uh, would probably help but drop the e-brake, right? All right, now I've heard people tell me double clutch and all this other stuff. Let's see if we can get this thing to shift into first. Go to second, okay. And they said double clutch. Oh, is that first? It is, look at that. That's a pain in the ass to do though for every time you're starting off. I'm not gonna lie to you. There's that buck, 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 buck. But she's running. She actually's running pretty good. She's not kicking as bad as she normally would when you're first starting out with her. So I can't complain there. shifting out a little bit better as I spend more time with it. She's bucking. She's not happy about this cold. I don't care. You're going to drive. <laughs> You're going to drive today, bitch. <laughs> Let's go. We're going to break that 71,000 miles. I ain't trying to hear it. I need it. I need it in my life. 71,000 miles. Let's go. I need it. And you're going to give it to me. You're going to give me this 71,000 miles. Nope, I don't care. I don't care. You are going to give me... Woo! That's all I can ask for her, right? I don't like the bucking thing, but I have a feeling I know what to do. That's why she's gonna go get a carb today. But look, we're about to break that 71,000 miles, man. <laughs> and that's all I wanna do, man. I wanna get this in on this car. Half a mile, man.
a mile and we got it, man. We just want to see that get in. I want to get this done. And I wanted to warm her up, get her a nice little run in, you know? She's running better as she runs. Still bucks on the uphill climbs, as you can hear now, but I mean, she's still driving. She's still driving. So I got no complaints. She downshifts in the second, nice. 71,000 miles, y'all see it, look at that. Ah, we got it. I'm happy about it. All right, guys, so needless to say, the car is running. It's, you know, the last time you guys saw it, I was on the side of the road and I was waiting on AAA and then the batteries on my GoPros died. Oh, so the positive news is, you know, we do got her back running with the new belt and all that stuff, she's good. I think once they replace the alternator later today, <clears throat> she's probably gonna run a lot better. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm excited, man. I wanted to give you guys a, a, a short update video on it so you guys can see her running and driving. And it's below freezing out here right now. And um, breaking 71,000 miles in this car, man, I, it, felt, it feels kind of special, man. It really does. It feels kind of special. You know, this old girl here, man. What can I say, man? Maybe, I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know if I should sell it or not. I know you guys probably saw this. Should I sell it? And I'm taking offers or whatever on the car, but I don't know, man. I don't know what to do. I really don't. I really, really enjoy the car. But she just needs so much stuff that I'm not, it's not my wheelhouse, man. I don't know. We'll have to see, man. Um, ooh, somebody got that boom, boom going. Needless to say, in an upcoming video, you guys will get to see this thing going over to the shop to get the carb replaced, so stay tuned for that. That's going to wrap it up for this one. I want to give a major shout out and a major thank you to uh, Randy over at Auto Auction Rebuilds for keeping the battery tender and stuff on this and, and looking out for me on this car, man. I truly appreciate you, bro. And uh, Austin as well, you know, for taking care of the battery stuff in the first place. And um, yeah, I'm, ha I'm happy. I'm kind of happy to see that this thing actually still runs <laughs> so i guess we'll see what happens man let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below um regardless i'm even if i'm selling it i still got to do the carb so i already bought it so i'm gonna have it installed and uh see if it makes a difference in how she runs but uh there you have it man um i'm gonna park her up uh i gotta get a couple things together because I have, the time am I supposed to be? I'm supposed to be at the shop at 12.30. So I got a little over an hour, and the shop's really like a mile from here, so it's not far. So I'm going to take care of a couple other things here, and we'll get another video for you guys. Uh, we'll get another video for you guys on this thing here very soon. I see Randy's commenting on my Instagram right now. So um, I really appreciate you guys watching the video. If you guys are liking the classic car content with the 1953 Pontiac, the best way you can tell me that is by hitting that thumbs up button. When y'all hit that thumbs up button, when I see a thousand likes on a video or 500 or 600 likes, I know you guys are liking the content. I'll continue to make it. I won't sell the car, you know, but like if the videos are getting like 50 likes or a hundred likes, whatever, it tells me that you guys really aren't into it. And I got to move to do other things, but listen to that, man. She just fires right up. Can't beat that, man. She just can't beat it, man. She's a beast. Anyways, guys, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. I thoroughly am enjoying this car. That's all I can say. And it is an absolute thing of beauty, man. I mean... Everybody gave Randy shit about the purple color, but I like it. I like the metal flake and stuff that you see in it. It's a beautiful color. It's a beautiful car. <sighs> I really enjoy it. I really enjoy it. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. And uh, I will see you guys on the next one. Peace. For the longest time. Whoa.
Perfect. Perfect.